Welcome everyone to HFN. Today is November 22nd, 2019. Here to give you all XRP's price prediction plus is XRP recycling news. We're going to talk about that today on this video. But before I get started, definitely you appreciate our content. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that bell notification because when we upload here on this platform, you definitely want to watch the video because we're giving you our forecast price movement before the market actually moves in the cryptocurrency space like share the video follow us on twitter facebook and then on our website in order to become part of our community of where we anticipate price movement in the stock market commodities forex and even in the cryptocurrency space so all the links will be there in the description of this video now i wanted to talk to you all about Ripple XRP possibly recycling news and content about their company and the type of partnerships that they're doing. Okay. I saw this article, this one right here, came out today, well, yesterday, the 21st of November, talking about Mercury FX and how they're going to use Ripple's platform to reach the inaccessible markets. They're going to use XRP on what was once called X Rapid, which is now called on demand liquidity. And I went ahead and highlighted some of the same information that I saw on another article that came out in the beginning of this year. OK, so this article Keep in mind, this is the current article for Mercury FX. And look at this picture right here. Okay. Mercury FX, you have two men sitting there on a table talking about, I take it, Mercury FX. Now, the international payment company Mercury FX has recently joined Ripple in an effort to make quick transfers with a low value around the world. The CEO, Alistair Constance, informed that highly valued transactions were the sweet spot for their company. But now the higher level ups see that there's some space to grow in the cross border payments as well. Why? Because Ripple can enable payments to be at least 100 times faster than they were before using RippleNet. With this on-demand liquidity ODL, which was formerly known as X Rapid, Ripple was able to create a connection between the United States dollar and the Mexican peso. The CEO believes of Mercury FX believes that this will open up new payment channels and really start to make these transfers economically viable. The price to send money went from $50 to $2. This will greatly benefit big companies that are clients of Mercury FX. Now, the company is expected to continue using the ODL product to reach other countries. United Arab Immigrants, the Philippines, are two countries that have a demand for what Ripple possess. Okay. So this article was yesterday. Let's take a look at the one that we found as well, which is dated March 22nd, 2019. Mercury FX powered by X Rapid or what is now ODL XRP reports 1.8 billion in remittances worldwide. The ripple expansion continues. Is that not what the beginning half of this article talked about? 
expanding the Ripple network across the world. Mercury FX CEO Alistair Constance was interviewed by Decrypt Media and spoke of the firm's plans for X-Rapid and expansion. This is a tweet from Mercury FX Limited. X-Rapid is the future, says our CEO Alistar. Constance. You see that picture? Was when was this picture take, taken? Because it's attached to this tweet on February the 6th, 2019. The image that you see on this article from yesterday is the same image that is from this tweet from September 6th, 2019. What's going on in the cryptocurrency space? Are people simply grabbing outdated articles and recycling them for these cryptocurrencies? That that's what seems to be going on with XRP and Ripple. Ripple's X Rapid, which went live last October, is a solution for banks and financial institutions that would like to transfer money internationally at a lower cost x rapid brings increased liquidity at a lower price so they have been doing this all the way since at least march 22nd 2019 mercury fx trying to expand and use xrp why is it making news today joins RippleNet. mercury fx join RippleNet back in March 22nd, 2019. Just something I find odd and just one of the many points and reasons why we do not focus on articles because seemingly these, well, this article right here is outdated. Okay, it has came out back in the beginning half of 2019 and it's just simply being recycled. And many people would grab this article right here and try to substantiate a bullish case for XRP when in fact the market has already possibly priced that in if you were to follow the article. So now you'll find people come out with articles saying how Mercury FX joins RippleNet or they plan to increase uh, the XRP usage to reach inaccessible markets yes but that's already been talked about right here on this article so this is just another situation to where i really want to emphasize the usage of the price chart to get your information the money does not lie okay you can see right here that articles can be recycled can be reused just to drum up some excitement and possibly some usage into the direction in which they want a particular asset to go. Okay, so let's talk about XRP now and our forecast for this market. You guys can see right here, we did our video in XRP uh, November the 19th, 2019. We played it on the three hour chart. So what we're going to do, we're gonna show you the market in XRP and it did come up here to our TP area uh, it was a little bit short from our ultimate TP area but we did say that uh, 25 and a half cents would have been our TP price if you was able to grab a little bit higher that's great but overall we knew that the market resistance was going to come in right around this particular area okay was anticipating it to come around that particular area there okay so if you was able to grab that out the market maybe about two percent and check this out right before right after the market came and hit our TP price it completely dropped 
that's not a surprise once you understand how to read these price charts you'll be able to time the market that's the biggest lack of experience that many people have in this space timing so you guys can see that 2.12 percent had in that particular forecast we're going to get rid of it and now we need to talk um, we are going to clean up this chart I know that sounds funny because we do not have a lot of things on our chart but I want you to show you that this line right here is not playing a role in the price action of XRP so let's get rid of it so there we are what I'm going to do now I'm going to bring this down just a tad okay and we're going to play with this line now as the resistance area for XRP now obviously when you look at the background of this chart this is the last hope in the market for XRP to find some support market came all the way down to 22 cents today in trading so again this is the second time of us clipping and touching 22 and a half 23 cents so naturally the first price movement expectation is to get consolidation of trading real quick look at XRP on the weekly time frame and again this is the third consecutive week right now of us continuing to see some lower prices in this crypto okay we have to break back up above 25 cents in order to see a change in tone until that occurs this market will consolidate and weakness will be more prevalent and more appearing than the strength I'm telling you that now 25 cents if we don't break about 25 cents you know what the expectations will be consolidation of trading and movement to the downside all right A couple more days left to end out the month of November and yes it can change but right now this price bar is real weak in XRP uh, even at the last four months we only had one up month and that was last month in October so th this cryptocurrency is not looking strong yet not in the long term and not even on the daily all right so Let's play this one on a small time frame, okay? Uh, definitely, we're seeing some indications of some support trying to come to the market. Near term resistance is right there around 23 and a half cents, okay? We able to break that above to the upside, that would be great to at least hit the market at 24 cents, okay? Now, we're still seeing some indications of stockpile coming into the market for XRP, um, but it is being consumed by the participation of the market, okay? So we are going to play the market right now in XRP, uh, moving higher in price, but we're gonna play this on a small time frame. I'm telling you this now. One of the concerns I do have is that 23 and a half cents has not been breached to the upside for the last five two hour price bars. That is a little bit concerning, but um, we're gonna play the market trying to hit that 24 cent price and XRP to the upside. We're playing this on a very small time frame. TP will be at 23 and a half cents because I know that previously the market did get hit with some resistance there. So 23 and a half cents would be about 0.83% profit in the market for XRP for our take profit, okay? But this is what we're gonna ride with. This is our expectation. We're going to play it on a small time frame because we have seen some volatility coming to the market for XRP. Two hour time frame, TP 23 and a half cents, only under the visualization of seeing weakness entering the market at that price. If we don't see it, the market is, the forecast is going to continue to play out. Okay. So, questions, comments, let us know. Make sure you always maintain your profitability, and I will see you on the next one.